In this video, I'll show you the absolute quickest way to update your games to the latest DLSS version. Step one in this process is going to techpowerup.com forward slash download and going to the drivers section and we'll notice NVIDIA DLSS frame generation, DLSS and ray reconstruction all at 3.7.1 or 0.0. We'll download the DLSS file, the base file. And then we'll go back and we'll download the other two as well. So we have the DLSS. Now let's do the frame generation file, get that downloaded, hit download, and just use one of the mirrors there and look how quickly that downloads. Isn't that beautiful? And last but not least, the Ray Reconstruction DLL. We'll click on that, get that downloaded, and have all those zip files in our downloads folder. And step two in this process, we want to go into our downloads folder and we want to extract the three files that we just downloaded, get those into uh, folders we can work with and those DLL files. Get all three of those extracted there and now we have something to work with. And we'll just delete all those zip files. Now I made this chart to show you the file names. Regular DLSS is just nvngx underscore DLSS dot DLL, while frame generation and ray reconstruction have a G and a D respectively at the end of DLSS. Those are the files you'll be looking for when we do the search. Now we're gonna find the folder or drive that your games are located in, and we're gonna type in nvngx star dot star in the search box and that will bring up any game that has nvidia dlss technology and the respective files so let's pick one here uh, battlefield 5 dlss that probably hasn't been updated in a while we're going to open file location we'll find that file that's highlighted and rename the end of that to dot backup that way you always have a copy of that original file then we go back to downloads, look for the DLSS base file, 3.7.1, there it is. And we'll just simply copy that, go back to your game folder, and in there somewhere, just right click and paste. And your game is now updated to the latest DLSS. Now let's pick a game that has frame generation. Here we go to finals, we'll right click on that, hit open file location. At the end of that, we're gonna type in dot backup, that way we have that original file. And let's go back into downloads and look for that frame generation 3.7.1. And we'll hop into that file, we'll right click and we'll copy that and go back to our game folder, right click and paste. It is simple as that folks. One last example, let's do a ray reconstruction file. And that is cyberpunk, right click on it, open file location, rename the end of that to dot backup not backy up and go into downloads look for that DLSSD file right click on that copy right click paste we are done folks that is how easy it is to update your DLSS games to the latest DLSS this is Trollbender with Trolls Tech thanks for watching this video I love you people